Congratulations on the win today, Gemma. Uh, how do you feel? Yeah, over the moon really. You know, that's been that's been a long time coming, and I think you look at our performances over the last sort of nine Premiership games, it's, it's been building to something like that. So, just just good for the boys to get a win line and get a bonus point. We came out of the blocks incredibly quickly uh, this week. Was it uh, part of the plan to uh, start quickly? Um, I suppose. We we got a bit lucky in them first 10 minutes, really, you know, two charge downs and fair play to Johnny and, uh, and Peely for doing that. And you know, it really sort of springboarded us and, and gave us that confidence to play. So it probably helps us, but, you know, it, it wasn't really the plan to get two charge downs that early on. Um, the stadium is, I don't know about you and uh, the rest of the lads, but it's starting to feel like home now. Um, what about, you know, the word for the uh, vocal support tonight? Yeah, you know, the fans were awesome tonight and, you know, it's nice to hear that they've got a voice and, and they're right behind the boys and they've been there all year and it's just nice that we can pay them back and, you know, urge to keep coming along every week and let's try and sell that place out. Um, next week we uh, we got a trip to Northampton, uh, thoughts about that? Yeah, you know, it's, it's going to be a tough game. Franklin's Gardens is, is renowned for, for how they play and they've got a big forward pack that we're going to have to front up against, but, you know, there's a little bit of pressure off us now and hopefully we can go down, down there, have a crack and, and see what happens. Final word, Johnny Lotus hair. Awesome. <laughs> well done today. Thank you very much. Well done on the win today. Uh, what are your thoughts? Yeah, obviously delighted, you know. Um, we knew we had to put a huge performance in tonight. Um, we talked about the attitude going into the game and that was going to be key for us. Um, and I thought we really delivered first half. A little bit of a walk sort of first 20 of the second half and then pushed on uh, again for the last 20. We got the three tries really early on. Did you, uh, when you were on the pitch, were you uh, worried ever so much that we didn't get that uh, fourth try? Uh, you know, it was, it was, the win was the massive thing for us. We it, and then once we got those three, we were obviously trying to push for that fourth. Um, but the win was the biggest thing. But, you know, we're obviously delighted to get the, uh, to get the fourth. I don't know about you, but uh, this place is uh, starting to feel like home now. Uh, what are you, a few words about the vocal support tonight? Uh, the crowd is unbelievable. It's, it really is starting to feel like home. It, it definitely takes a little bit of time to bed in. Um, it takes a bit of time to, you know, get familiar surroundings and things. But, uh, yeah, the crowd are outstanding. And, and they have been all season, to be fair. They're faithful of, of travelled with us home and away. Um, and they were huge tonight, made some real noise. Uh, tough trip against, uh, tough trip to Northampton next week. What are your thoughts on that? Yeah, it's going you know, to be a huge one again. I keep saying this in interviews that every week in the Premiership is so tough. Um, they're obviously pushing for top four, um, same as it was tonight. Away from home is always difficult. Franklin Gardens is a, is a great place to play, but a difficult place, so it's going to be tough. And one final question what are your thoughts on uh, Johnny Leota's hair? Oh, it's awesome. <laughs> Mr. T. <laughs> Mr. T, Mr. indeed. <laughs> well, congratulations tonight. Thank you. Lads, uh, well done on the win tonight. Uh, what are your thoughts on it? Yeah, I think I, I thought it was an overall um, effort from the team. Uh, you know, we played to our structures and that that we have uh, been working on the last week, and uh, you know, it just shows you know if we can hold on to the ball, we can score some good tries. Yeah, I, I can care. <laughs> um, any? Were you uh, ever so worried uh, during the game? You know, we got the three tries really early on. Uh, were you worried that we weren't going to get that uh, all important fourth? Yeah, I think we were pretty confident, especially in our D. Our D was pretty much in the tone for our attack as well. So we, <laughs> we played it well. We, we did all right in our tech following after it. So uh, A quick word on uh, uh, your try tonight. Um, you know, what, uh, quite lucky of sorts, you know, with the bounce and everything. Yeah, I think Johnny was lucky because um, you know <laughs> both times I was sort of on the inside of him, and you could hear me coming, so he sort of it sort of pushed Selfish. him a bit, yeah, pushed him a bit harder to uh, to get the ball. That's just what happens when you're faster than another person. <laughs> the other person. I'm just a team player, you know. Did you think? Did you think you got that second try, which uh, the team owners uh, allowed? I can guarantee you, 100 percent that was a try. They said it wasn't, but granted, but I looked at the ball when I granted, and I was just thinking, oh. Yeah. Quick word on the uh, support tonight. You know, I don't know about you, but it's starting to feel like home to me. So yeah, it is. It is. Um, you know, it took a while for us to sort of get used to this place, um, but now, you know, and especially with the home crowd now, you know, it's just awesome that everyone's sort of, we're getting a lot of fans now, and it's just awesome to be out there and then just hearing them sh um, chanting uh, Mr. T. <laughs> yeah. yeah, quick word about the hair. Uh, could you explain, um, could you explain it, <laughs> the reason for it? Well, it's on the fundraising some money for uh, Luca, who um, lost the legs through meningitis, and the start of this week I only had 4.50, so I was... I knew I was going to cut my hair on the first day, so I tried to get more money. So I said, if I could get to 850, then I'd get a Mr. T haircut. And obviously, the boys rallied up and a few of the supporters, and they topped it up in four days. So here we are. What are your thoughts on it? Oh, you suits him, mate. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Quick word on uh, Northampton next week. Tough challenge. Yeah, it, it's going to be a tough challenge. Um, 
you know, um, you know, we just have to, uh, you know, good teams um, get win, uh, get back to back wins. You know, so uh, it's just a, a good time for us to sort of try and uh, go down there and, and tip them over. You know, uh, for them it's a crucial game for them because they obviously want to stay in the top four. Um, so yeah. Enjoy the night tonight, lads. Well, uh, congratulations. Thanks, mate. Uh, well Cheers, done. mate. Thanks, see you in a bit.